Up in Logan, another in-state matchup. This one between Utah State and Weber State. Weber State looking for its first victory over an FBS team since 1993. Looked bad for them early. They had a 3-0 lead, but then Vaughn takes the kickoff a few yards deep in the end zone. He brings it out. He's got an opening, and he is gone. Wins the foot race up the sideline. Vaughn takes it 100 yards for the touchdown. Utah State up 7-3, but then the Wildcats come right back. The give to running back Josh Davis. He goes untouched up the middle, 17 yards to the end zone, 10-7 Weaver. It was 13-7 in the third quarter when Wildcat quarterback Bronson Barron finds Ty McPherson on the fade route, corner of the end zone, touchdown, then the extra point. How good is this? The holder, the fake. He takes it right up the gut, two-point conversion, makes it 21-7. Still in the third, Bonner with a pass over the middle, but Williams steps in front of it, picks this one off, returns it to the house for the pick six. Weaver State just rolling, and in the fourth quarter, Barron to McPherson, another touchdown for that pair. Weber State travels up the road, knocks off Utah State in Logan, 35-7, the final. Weber now 2-0. The Aggies fall to 1-2. Just a huge victory for Weber State. This is for sure one of the best, and it rivals those playoff wins, and it rivals a lot of great games I've been involved with. And like I say, so proud of the players. They executed the game plan so well, and they were tougher than Nels tonight, and they came with a purpose.